welcome back to my vlog guys i'm excited i'm going to the country today yep and my country when i say country i mean saint mary all right so arakabessa saint mary jacks river saint mary here i come yeah so we're about to hit the highway to ocherius that's highway from Kingston to Ocherius, the North South Highway. Ta da! Beautiful, beautiful Jamaica. Pretty road. Look at the hills and the mountains. Remember when you're on the highway, guys, look out for the red and black pants, man. Because you don't want a ticket. Same thing. What I tell you. Go. Picking up is no joke. This is no joke. Picking Aki is serious business. And this bamboo is heavy. My shoulders, my shoulder hurts. Oh yes. No man, I can't manage the Aki picking thing. Look at the thing. No. I will pick up. <laughs> my mom is attempting to climb a tree. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm 
Swing dia kok swing apa tau Kain raya kaki ya deh Apa rasa dengan flag tu, Azlan? No, really. Kat mama up in the tree. Nga tuan ko, Azlan. Nga tuan ko, Azlan. Yes, I have no no. Hey, come on, a video, man, video. I'm Nice, nice. What kind of breakfast is that? Oh. Are you going to climb the tree? Yeah, mm. It's a big tree? Mm. Oh, I don't need a burst, man. Picking Nesbury in the country. You the stick? Alright, sit here. I love coming to the country. I get to pick my own fruits. Oh my gosh. I like buying these in Kingston. Very expensive. But now they're come free. To the <laughs> That's right. <laughs> come to the country, you just go to the backyard and pick. I picked Akis today. I'm picking Nesbury. We picked breadfruit. Oh my gosh. Ah, I love the country. St. Mary. Jack Servo, Corn Hill. This is my stomping ground. I was born in St. Mary. Jack Servo, more specifically, Corn Hill. All right, that's where I'm at now. So, I'm trying to get my supply of fruit before I go back to Kingston. I can't afford to buy fruit in Kingston. Oh my gosh, it's nice, right? Bring it to my eyes. Not the stain, the little dusty looking thing. Yeah, 
Oh, really? I inside of it? Right. I'm gonna add these now to the ones that I picked before. Oh, I love the country. Absolutely love. Yeah. Yeah, Nainsbury for days. For dinner too. This way. This way. This way. Okay. All right. So time to pick limes. Fish don't grow on trees. Bottom, then they're not ready. Uh, Lime. So this one isn't ready, mm. but this one is. And I'm not first, I'm <laughs> first, I'm ready. Oh, so one right there. Yeah. Underground. Oh, I completely forgot that there were spikes in this tree. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's leave some for mama. Let's not pick all of them. Alright. <laughs> Alright, let me show you the tuna. You say you don't know what's a tuna. I mean, I know what it is. It's a fish. But they most definitely do not grow on trees. <laughs> Alright. That's illegal. Come, let me show you. And this is a cocoa plant, by the way. Cocoa. Oh. This is what I've been looking for. That's a cool Alright. This is. Oh, I can't leave. Forget my stick. Come on, let me show you the tool. Oh, this is called a tuna plant. Looks like it's a family of the cactus. Yeah. It's interesting. Yeah. So, um, okay, so it's not can really I touch it? Realize that yeah. it has um, oh, it has spikes on the yes, side. Yes, it But this plant, this plant, back when I was a child, my mother used to wash my hair with it. If you pick it, and I think she used to scrape it, it gets real sudy. 
and she used to just wet the hair and lather it up in the hair and set up the hair with it. And if I can, let me see. A lizard. Where? Let me see if I can okay. show you. Oh, oh this. Oh, this oops, my limes. Oh, no. My limes. You're gonna have to go to the. Oh, careful, there are some spots. Careful. Oh, yeah. Look at this one, guys. Oh, this Let me see. I think the one I picked this part. Oh, yeah. No one can touch that. It's not that bad. All right, Kimani, can you hold the stick for me with the lens? Let me see if I can show you. All right, so this is a tuna plant. I think this one is young. I've seen these. I think it's young. I've seen them. Before. But oh yes, you can see. Look at that. It's getting really. Sorry, right? It looks so. It reminds me of aloe vera, the smell and everything. Yeah, there's an aloe vera plant right beside it. Yep. I think they're all from the same family. I think. Let me see if I get a bigger one. I think this one is young. This is in my grandmother's backyard, guys. This is what a backyard is like in St. Mary. Oh my gosh. I think that one was young. I'm trying to get one of the bigger ones to see. Let's try this one. Oh, there's a lizard over there. Yeah. Oh, look at that. I'm not sure how they used to do it, but they rub it and it gets, I think this one is, I'm not sure, guys. I'm not sure. You have to ask your mother. Yeah. But I, it's probably a small one, but I know that they used to rub it up and it gets slow, study, study, study. They wet the hair and soak up the hair. And that's what we used to shampoo our hair. We didn't have all the fancy, fancy, dancy shampoos that we're using now. But yeah, the tuna used to do it. And I think she used to use the aloe vera sometimes too. So not sure. All right. Okay, so I got plantains. I got coconuts. I got limes. I got nesberry. got mango. What else did I get? Breadfruit. That, look at that, that's yam. Yeah. Yam. Let me step over there. Okay. Oops. My lines keep falling out. Oh. This is a yam plant. Oh. So, so this so is the actual yam. yam. Yeah, but the yam is underground. So, well, it, I this, guess this kind of looks like it was painted. This is it right, here. right, so this is a yam vine. Yam vines, as you know, run on other trees, almost like a parasite, but it doesn't feed on the tree that it runs on. All right, and of course, you know, yam grows underground, and I think once the plant itself starts drying down, they know that the yam is ready, and they'll find the root of it, right? And then they'll start digging, and yeah. that's where they find the yam. Okay, I didn't know that's what the whole process. Yes, so that is it for your country lesson. Let's <laughs> move <laughs> on number one. <laughs> oh, look at this. This is the leaf of life. Oh, pepper, pepper, pepper. Wait, you, pepper. you take pepper over life? No, hold on. Pepper. Stealing my grandmother's pepper. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I was saying that this is called the leaf of life. I remember my mother. Um, when I was much younger, when I had a cool, she would take it. Yeah, I think it can make tea, but she used to, she used to um, take it and crush it and wring it. Put it in like a piece of cloth and wring it and get the juice out of it. Add a little salt to it and give it to me to drink. They say it's good for a cool. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It is so good. Coming back to the country though, like, I love it. I love the scenery. It's nice. Your scale is a dog? Yes. I yeah, me too. The, that chain is way too long. Whatever. Hello. Are you gonna like. <laughs> no, don't do that. Sudden? Is it sudden? Yep. Alright, we'll look at it when we reach up that side. Come. 
I love going to St. Mary. I got maize berries, berries, got apples, got coconut, got limes. Yeah. I got mommy. Mommy, I don't know if you know what mommy is. I think it's spelled M A M. M-A-A-M-E-E, -E -E, I think. But you can check it out if you don't know what this is. And guess what? It is an aphrodisiac. Yeah. I also got bread fruit that's already in the oven. What else did I get? Oh, yeah. I also got avocado. Pear. We call it pear in Jamaica. All right, guys. That was it for my country run. Remember to like. Comment, share, and subscribe to Sangay's Lens for more interesting videos. Until next time, walk good.